So we'll get this off and then I'll explain what's going on. Things we do for the live streams, eh? Looks incredible. <laughs> Who's a pretty boy then? Good morning, everybody. It's the start of the week here at Suarez HQ. Beautiful sunny day. And we start the day off with a paint delivery and we well, have friends have come to fix the roof because we've got a leak. So we better get opened up and get a move on. Right, well, we've, uh, we've got a very, very big week coming up, isn't it always? Uh, I think we've got uh, something pretty groundbreaking happening with the live stream. Well, fingers crossed we can pull it off this week. <sighs> I've written the list out and the list literally goes from here to the bottom of the floor. So we are gonna press on. I think it's gonna be quite an exciting one. So sit down, grab a drink, stay right where you are. And let's show you what a week here is like at Suarez HQ. Right, buddy, we've had quite a delivery, haven't we? Yeah. Right, then should we crack this open and see what we've got? Let's see what we got. Actually, we've got such a lot coming in today, I forget what's in here. There's so much going on. Oh, oh more paint. Look at that. <clears throat> so that, I'm thinking, is all the gold, mate. Is that right? It is. So that is, yes, that's gold. What's that one? And that one is copper. Uh, Ooh, copper. nice copper. So this should be another gold, I think. Copper. Oh, no, that's brushed silver, is oh, it? Is that, is that Sorry, my apologies. Uh, brush, spray, brush. Oh, that's, yeah, that's bright silver. Oh, yeah. that's a, Ooh. a dent in the walls, isn't it? That one is gold. And that one is, oh, two golds. We've got two golds. Awesome. And a ton of paperwork. Yeah. And data sheets and all that kind of stuff. Awesome. Plus our other delivery. Let's have a look at what we got there, buddy. Okay, so in here somewhere we should have a black semi. Yes, black okay, 9001, that's white. Black, okay. yes, I've got black. Got a two somewhere. black. Oh, Viola, Suarez Viola. Oh, look, Viola, look. Okay. Oh, yes. See, people don't believe us when we say we've got our own colour, but that is a genuine Suarez colour not available anywhere else. Viola. Mmm, and Piaggio Verde at long last. Hurrah. Hey. And what's the last one? 9006, that is silver. Oh yeah, a little experiment. And a little, yeah, so what colour is that? Is that copper? Old penny bronze. bronze. Old penny bronze. Okay. That's going to be fun. And finally, oh, we'll be all right, mate. We can have a relax later. Look, we got alcohol. Yeah, that went up three times in price. <laughs> yes. Yeah, thanks, COVID. Right, that's okay. two of the deliveries. Oh, and the polycarb sheet. Oh, and the polycarb sheet. Ready for the next project, which I'm going to work on. Yes. This is going to push back the frontiers of the live stream yet again. <laughs> well, no pressure on you, obviously. No, no. <laughs> I still need a haircut. Still needs a haircut. Yeah, look at that. Oh, I, offered, I offered to do it for him, but for some reason he said no. Uh, well, uh, I don't know. Uh, we know the leaks are. Yeah, what about that one? Are you, what do you think? Well, no, I'm more than happy to do it. I reckon, where's it stop? That's the thing. It's no, it's definitely a high point here, so everything's going to be going that way. Yeah, that's what Ed said. This, yeah. this is what happens the when the roof leak. leaks. See, and the roof uh, leaks and you have to start filling holes up in the floor, which is why the roofing contractor is here, because water is ingressing downstairs to the business down below. So uh, yeah, today we're grinding out bits of the floor and filling it, trying to stop the water from getting down below. Right then guys, so um, as I've said already, I did come in at the weekend and did a little bit of painting. So Adi and I are both gonna go in and have a look inside the pod. Neither one of us has seen what it looks like yet, genuinely. Let me go and turn the extractor off. Oh, say it again. Yeah, light, oh, lights are already on. I think I did those earlier. So neither one of us have seen this and I did some a little bit of experimentation with a brand new paint and a couple of different styles. So, shall, shall we go and have a look? This time we'll follow AD in. <laughs> oh, I can barely stand the excitement. Anticipation, right? Let's go and have a look, shall we? How about that? Wow. Oh, wow. Yes. Yeah, mate, this is. <laughs> right. 
We, we have a lot of reactions, as you probably know now if you've seen these videos before, and they are all <laughs> genuine. First time I've walked in since I stepped out of here on Saturday, and I wanted Adi to see him because he, he, I didn't even tell him what I was doing. So let me explain here, guys, what we've done here on this one is use a different version, quite a different version of the paints. One of the things we're always trying to do is push back the boundaries of what our paints can do. So we had a couple of weeks ago, a brilliant meeting with the laboratory manager uh, for the paint supplier and came up with a new formulation of the paints. So this is the very first one that we've tried with that new formulation, which I have to say goes off very, very quickly. But as you're probably gonna see on some of these images, what has transpired just looks incredible. So I'm super pleased with that. Right, bud, so this, yeah. this, is, this is the other one. So just having a little, um, again, a little play around. Now this is done in the normal paints, but um, I, had, I, I mixed a few different chemicals together and used a few different tools. And I wanted just to see, you know, kind of this, you know what? They are happening. Yeah. It's cool. starting to happen, those little jellyfish. Yeah, they are like jellyfish, aren't they? Little front little anemones. Yeah. So I just want to have a little play with gold and pink and orange and some grey and some cream and some black. And then Why? How do you like that? Yes. How do you like that, mate? Why? So this is something quite unexpected, yeah. Separation on that's pretty incredible. And never the twain shall meet. <laughs> now what do you reckon to that then? Yeah, so this, this was interesting. Um, so again, I've, I've, I've mixed a few different chemicals up with the paints and uh, just layered them in a slightly different way. Um, but look at what we've got. I kind of got this really hard edge boundary and then all these soft sort of milky kind of swampy, almost satellite image shapes going in as well. But that, very, very happy with that. What a classic. What yeah. an absolute classic. So yeah, dude, I, I deliberately didn't tell you about these because I thought you're know, the greatest judge of, uh, of all these things. If you could see them blind without seeing them before, yeah. that gives us a really good idea about whether we're getting any closer to, uh, to something yeah, monumental. Got, uh... I might also point out that the paints are twice the price of the normal ones as well. <laughs> so we're right on that cutting edge of what's, what's physically able to be done with these paints. But that's, that's part of it. We're always just pushing those boundaries all the time. This is how we improve and get better. Yeah. But that, I gotta say, for a, a day long session on Saturday was fantastic. I'm so super pleased with that, mate. Job, job done, I reckon. Right, that's the roof done. So while our friends are just finishing off, I am gonna get some stuff out of the van because I've got a boatload of things we bought this morning. Right, even before we got in. So I've got timber to get out, uh, lots of stuff from a very popular internet shopping company who shall not be named. Right, let me crack on with that. Right then, what we got in here? Oh, coffee cups and spoons. Although I did try to get the biodegradable ones. Hmm. What else we got? Oh, a light. Ooh, a light for the phone. Oh, this is where it gets fun. Tape measure. Tape measure. Tape measure. Now, here we go. This is the exciting one. Oh, yeah. Ooh, right. look. I'll, I'll crack it open. Let's now. have a look. Let's see. I'm trying to see what this looks like. At considerable cost because we actually, because we're record, recording so much video and creating so much data, We've also got to redress our storage issues because we are rapidly running out of storage space for all the sheer huge amounts of data that we're doing, whether it be live streaming, doing the vlogging. So here we go. Terra Master. I even love the name. So this is our first foray into having a NAS drive. I even had to look up what NAS meant, but there we go. Oh, I like that. That's rather nice, mate. Yes. So there we go. We'll be able to pop two drives in there and have some network storage. So now all we need is the hideously expensive hard drives to go inside them. Anyway, job done. That is network storage. If you're new here and like what we do, then don't forget to subscribe and click on the bell icon so you don't miss any of our upcoming videos. Right, so I'm gonna try selfie mode here. Now, 
you might help, be able to see because is recording me recording is we're trying out this new selfie light so we've just crudely rigged up a rig rigged up a rig done that anyway just to see if we walk into a fairly dimly lit environment there we go look, we're in the bowels of the building mate so yeah. let's see as i sort of go around here and i'll turn against the black whether uh, that actually makes any difference to my face hopefully so, you can see that a little bit better now so we'll a, a, a so let's switch the light switch off. off light off and then we'll see whether there's a difference right so light off and then let's go light on i am illuminated oh there we go so we'll see that so that's light <laughs> off okay let's see how the cameras cope yeah. with that right yeah. light off light on wicked look at that so where i am now omnipresent mate wherever you go you yes. can see me there you are you lucky people <laughs> right so that's like no. <laughs> no i gotta keep walking look yes now let's go actually into the daylight it's probably not gonna make any difference but let's yeah, do it a, let's do it let's do a daylight test so here we are daylight light shining off my lovely head and that's off and that's on so they don't really tell any difference but let's go out into the lobby and see how we get on there see i think actually that that's not bad that's probably there we are so non-illuminated illuminated it's very illuminating it is excellent right well that is the selfie light ring test right we've got a gap a blank wall from where we sold one on thursday last week and fortunately or unfortunately depending on your viewpoint we've also got a blank wall there pardon the flicker so i think i better go hunting and see if i can put something where those white walls are i like staring at white walls let's go find something right ah oh, yes much better much much better apart from the flickering lights all right how you doing yeah, good, yeah you got a lot of these on board have you so. hey and there it is okay that's quite big <laughs> So we'll get this off and then I'll explain what's going on. Right then, so you're probably wondering why we've got a five foot tall Kingfisher. Now this is all part of a Kingfisher trail which is being organized uh, here in the Cotswolds. There's 20, I think, or 21 artists taking part and they're gonna form part of an outdoor nature trail which should launch hopefully in the middle of the year. Uh, but now here we go, we've had ours delivered and I'm very, very, very privileged to say that we're part of the committee that actually put this thing together and chose other artists to be part of the trail so uh this is the day we've actually got ours which i think is pretty amazing to be honest with you let's have a proper look at it so all 20 or 21 of these are eventually uh, going to be out on uh, well a uh, trail that's going to go right through the Cotswolds and this is going to be one of them oh, that's pretty awesome mate. you're going to have a nice pose there we go look <laughs> excellent right so next job is we've got to try and get it inside the building and find some way to put it <laughs> should be good for that
there we go. Who's a pretty boy then? Lovely. So the five foot tall Kingfisher forming part of the Kingfisher Trail 2021 is here. And you just wait until you see what we're going to do with this. Honestly, time to get controversial, I think. Oh, yes. Can't wait to get going on you. Okay, five frames made up, long last, quite a bit of timber, and next job for me is to get this epic painting photographed. Right, Mr. Suarez, we're just going to swap those tonsils. Your mace may feel a little bit dry. <laughs> I'm going to knock some nails out. I'm going to pull some. You come here often. <laughs> I am, uh, <laughs> yes, I'm going to make a lot of noise now. Ow, just stabbed myself. I haven't done anything yet and I've just stabbed myself. Not right. Things we do for the live streams, eh? Right, polycarb sheet, check. Fixing timber on the back for the rotating bracket, check. Sticky sanitary sealant, check. Stick the whole lot together. So my wife says I'm I'm messy. I I can't see what she means. I, I mean, guys, come on. Am, am I messy? I mean, that's it's pretty tidy in there. Yeah, that's tidy. Time to go home. Bye bye birdie.